Hey everybody, it's Ped's Card Collection coming back at you with another video. And tonight we are going to be starting off a fresh brand new series. I got a case of 2022 Tops Update Jumbo Hobby Boxes. What better way to polish off an amazing year with one of the best releases in the last few years. This is probably my favorite release uh, since I've gotten back into collecting, getting that case this time last year of the regular hobby really um, grew my love for the set, the parallels, and everything in between. So I'm ready to rip this. I'm super excited. We're going to be doing this on a box by box basis, not like the last time where I live streamed the whole case and ripped every single last pack of one sitting in five and a half hours. We are going to be doing box by box, case by case. And let's get into it. 2022 Tops update. Hunting for Bobby Witt Jr. and Julio Rodriguez parallels. And I've been watching my buddy Casey Card Connection rip this like there's no tomorrow. And it has been so much fun to watch. I think he's got to be the king of this stuff. And I uh, looks like we got two box toppers. And Casey was saying he's going to call a gold black gold parallel in, the, in this box first box so i don't think i've ever pulled one of those and those are numbered at a 70 75 excuse me but how about two box toppers in the first one we got a 54 tops ted williams followed by an 83 tops tony Gwynn rookie reprint so a couple nice box toppers there two for the price of one and we are going to save the silver packs for the end but my gosh I love this stuff, and I haven't opened a hobby or a jumbo hobby for that matter, probably over a year. I think I opened a two and a half hobby box jumbo hobbies when this first came out, and uh, now we're gonna get our chance to open even more. So um, I'm gonna slide these packs on over. I'm gonna save the silver packs for the end, and we are just gonna get right into it, fellas. We're gonna skip the base because we've all seen the bulk we know what it's about so i don't want to bore you guys and gals with that but uh there's a, a bunch of other secondary rookies that are really really i think valuable and desirable and nice rookies that you can get that have really nice uh, future careers ahead of them that are very cheap right now uh specifically i'm looking for secondary guys like cj abrams rookie cards royce lewis O'Neal Cruz, Ryan Pepio even. I mean, there's Seiya Suzuki. I mean, I didn't see that card. That's just Al Thomas. You can get, you know, Nick Lodolo. And on and on and on. Jaron Duran, gold foil rookie. So he's turning it around. We got a red foil in this first pack. Let's see what this is going to be. Lucius Fox. So look at that, guys. First pack, two nice rookie parallels. And we got a Jose Ramirez and a Trevor Story. All righty. So nice two rookie parallels in the first pack. Guaranteed one autograph and two relics. That's what I like about the jumbo. You are guaranteed the autograph with the hobby. Extremely tough to pull. And um, let's get into it. We got pack number one in the books nice lucius fox red foil rookie card these cards are just so fun not to mention our beloved short prints are in this uh set this is before fanatics took over and uh put the put the axe down on the short prints i don't know why they did that now you can only get the golden mirror ssps but i think i speak for most of us when i said we we love these short prints. The super short prints you can get as well. We're hunting the Bobby Witt Jr. and Julio SSP rookies in this case. But I don't know why Tops or Fanatics did away with the regular SPs. The Golden Mirror just doesn't really do it for me. Super tough to pull, and they usually don't grade too well because of the, the way the stamp is mashed into the card. Um, but I guess they're uh, testing it out, so... Got another gold foil coming up next. These are only jumbo hobby exclusives, so you can't get these in the regular. And how about a nice Alec Thomas? So, guys, this stuff isn't 
pretty loaded. Nice Alec Thomas rookie. Casey was kind enough to inform me that they lowered the price recently, so I guess I just uh, got screwed on that and just paid that paid up, but <laughs> it's all good. We got a nice J-Rod rookie. There we go. Hopefully that's a sign of things to come, but still happy. I feel like the price I got it at was respectable, so all right. Here we go. This is a lot of fun, man. It's bringing back some good memories. Still have an autograph and two mem cards in our holster. And then the two silver mojo packs. But this stuff is just so nice. Love the card design. Checklist. You can get the Otani and Trout inserts. Is that a Suzuki? Wow, we are killing it on these parallels so far. We got a Suzuki uh, rookie. Oh, we got a couple couple numbers in this pack. We got a triple hit pack. That's also why I like the jumbos. You can get some juiced packs like Barry Bonds in his prime. Just juiced to the gills. I don't know why I went to go sleep. No offense, Mackenzie Gore. I do like you, but not that much. Uh, we got a Gavin Lux who should be back. And uh, hopefully he doesn't get caught by the injury bug again. I don't know how to even turn this around. Oh, we hit our autograph here. So we're just going to go for it and see what the hit is. It is going to be a black border. It is a Chicago White Sox. It's going to be a Lucas Giolito. So no rookie on the auto, but that's a pretty sharp looking card. Number to 199. Lucas Giolito. Hopefully uh, the Mets take a chance on him. I think he still has something left in the tank. So I'm going to get Mr. Giolito up on the stage. Nice numbered autograph. And we got something behind Seiya Suzuki Rainbow Foil. I think it's our first short print of the box. It's going to be a landscape. Oh, it's Kyle Schwarber. That's like the worst one to get, but we'll take it. Schwarbaum SP. But, I mean, every pack is just an adventure in itself. Let's get this Say It Ain't So rookie in the... Uh, up on the stage. All right, next up, make sure to hit that like button. Let me know what you think in the comments below. All right, we're gonna have a mem card. Looking for a black gold parallel. Those are tough to hit. All righty, here we go. Another gold foil. It's going to be a Ramon Urias. And we got a Pete Alonzo. Ooh, a little pinstripe. That's a sweet one. A little dirt, too. On the game used relic. Alec Manoa and a George Kirby rookie. So nice little pack there for the PC Pete Alonzo. All righty, let's keep it rolling. This is the last pack in the first half of the box. So far, I'd say we're doing pretty solid. You know, nothing too crazy, but we're churning out the hits. Just got to get that Bobby Witt to rear his head or Julio Rodriguez. So we're going to have a regular black gold in this pack. I think we're going to have a rainbow foil as well. Adam Ottavino. Oh, we got something turned around. Maybe an SP. Luis Robert on the black gold. Freddie Freeman and the Gabriel Arias. All right, let's see what this turned around card is. It's going to be our first gold of the box. So I'm seeing a yellow border. It is a rookie, it is a pirate, and it is a nice one. Jack Sawinski, not too shabby there. Gold number to 2022. All righty. The rookie parallels are coming out to play. Second half of the box. So hopefully we get some more rainbow foil. I like those parallels are tough to hit. And skipped right to a nice one in Bobby Witt Jr. So we got the wit, 
Gonna have another rainbow foil. Alex Colome. Oh, we had something out of 50 here, guys. Oh my gosh. We have either a Mother's Day or a Father's Day in this pack. Oh my gosh. Nice CJ on the Generation Now rookie. Oh man, this could be huge. We have a Mother's Day pink, ladies and gentlemen. This could be disgusting. It is a rookie. Brian Lavastida. Oof. So we did get a rookie, just not a huge name, unfortunately. But check that out. Mother's Day pink rookie card. Just loaded with parallels. So I'm going to get him on the board. Get Schwerber on over here. And you get Independence Day parallels, vintage stock, acetate, camos, Mother's Day, Father's Day, black parallels. I mean, there's a lot of stuff to chase in this. And you never know. You could pop out an Otani auto. You could pop him with the Trout auto, Bobby Witt rookie auto. Never know. All right, gold foil coming on up. A nice one, Brandon Marsh, rookie debut gold foil. Get that sleeved up in just a second. And a nice trap. All right, nice. Brandon Marsh. All right, three packs to go here. And then the flame finale. There's that black gold gold. We got a Bobby Witt Jr. debut. Bryce Elder on the foil rookie. That's another nice one. We got something. I think we have a home field advantage, guys. Wow. I think we have a home field advantage. Can also get those I forgot about. Joke, oh, Jake Odorizzi. Hopefully not Joke Odorizzi. But we got an HFA, which I completely forgot about. Let's hope it's a rookie. It's not. It's You like Jazz? Jazz Chisholm on the home field advantage. Pretty sweet card, though. Big Jazz Chisholm fan. So I like that one a lot. Let's get this Bryce Elder. Protected up as well. And we got two more packs here. And one more Relic we should be having. Maybe a manufactured... But this stuff is just bringing back the memes. Picture perfect. Sean Doolittle. Clevenger. And an Aussie Albies. So we are down to the last pack. Last regular pack. Should have a relic in here. Only one gold in this box. Oh my lord. What are you smoking? So we have a gold in this box. Uh, where's the relic? <laughs> Might have been short of the relic, but hopefully this hit makes up. Or I think I gave it away. I didn't see it, luckily, but you guys probably saw it. So Nice Stephen Kwan. J-Rod, black gold, rookie, really nicely centered. And then let's see what we got here. Stephen Kwan, let's see what this gold card is. I think it's a gold. Turn it around. Eric Fetty. All right, Eric Fetty. On the gold, but a nice Stephen Kwan rainbow foil. So let's set that down and then we'll do the silver packs here. Here we go. This is what we're working with going into the silver packs. So we got a nice little spread going. But let's get into these. Not 
not seeing anything thick in this first one. We got a Bryce Harper, Corey Seager, Joe Morgan, and a Javi Baez. Down for our last pack here. Don't think, oh wait, no, I don't think we have something, so. Got a John Duran, nice one there, rookie. Craig Biggio and a Chris Bryant. So that is going to do it for box number one of the case. Nice way to get our foot in the door. And I got a lot of nice hits. So let's do a recap here. Got some J-Rod rookies. Only one short print in this box, so hopefully that means some of the others have a plethora of short prints, but you never know. No massive hits, but a lot of nice hits that we can uh, take home with us. We got the Ramon Urias, Goldfoil, Clevenger, Colome, Ottavino, Duran, Fetty, J-Rod, J-Rod, Elder on the Foil Rookie, Quan Foil Rookie, Marsh, Gold Foil, Rookie, Sawinski, Gold, Jazz, HFA. we got the Duran, Gold Foil, Lucius Fox, Red, Suzuki, the Alonzo, Alec Thomas, Brian Lavastida, Mother's Day Pink Rookie out of 50, and the Lucas Giolito on-card autograph, black border, number to 199. So that's going to do it for the first box. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments below, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peds Card Collection out. Take care.